Hey, Tish, how are you? James, how are you? So what's going on? Well, I have these bifold doors that need to be hung. Right, good, let's do something about it. Okay. Tish Ganey took her bifold doors off when she painted her walls. A lot of people do this and never put them back on. So I have handyman Paul Schramm here to help because it is a little tricky. All right. There's pins and pivots on the door and a track that it all has to go into. I'm just gonna place this bracket down here. Now, you might already have a bracket there. Either way, get a measurement from that to a similar looking bracket inside the track hanging at the top of the door frame. We've got our measurement, and now we're gonna go over and measure the door and see what we have over there. On the bottom of your door is a pivot screw. A uh, little bit more. Adjust it until you get close to the same measurement. I backed it out a couple notches. How are we looking now? We're looking good. Now back to the door frame. Double check this distance from the wall to the center of this bracket and at the top up here from the wall to the center of this bracket. Line those up and now you can screw the bracket in if you needed to and go get the door. That pivot screw at the bottom of it fits into the bracket. Right, you're Perfect. In. Then up top. Just slide everything out to put the, the top guide pin into this hole. So that door's gotta go in at an angle. It's got to go in at an angle. See, this is the part where I'd tap out and quit. This is the part where people lose it, right. Keep your composure. It's easy. Guide pin oh, snaps in the track. There we go. Push everything over. Snap in another guide pin on the far side of the door. Pop that in there. It'll look good. And you've done it. Nice. I just was going to avoid the whole thing, but I am so glad that I got this done. It's so much better.